Imagine a world where beans become the unexpected villains. Hey everyone, welcome back to Microscopic Galaxy. Today we're diving into a fascinating topic that's both quirky and mysterious, Fauvism. It's not about your favorite things, it's actually a genetic quirk that can make certain foods a bit of a challenge for some people. Let's break it down in simple terms. So, what is Favism? Favism is a genetic condition that affects how the body reacts to a particular type of food called fava beans. Now, fava beans might sound harmless, but for individuals with favism, they can be like kryptonite. What happens to people with favism? Picture this, you enjoy a delicious meal that includes fava beans and everything seems fine. But for individuals with favism, this innocent looking legume can trigger a cascade of not so fun reactions. Why? Well, it turns out that some folks carry a genetic variant that affects their red blood cells. Fava beans contain a substance called vaccine, and when people with favism eat these beans, it can lead to the destruction of their red blood cells. This process is known as hemolysis. Essentially, it's like a tiny internal battle happening in their bodies. So, what are the symptoms of this bean-induced battle? Well, they can range from mild to severe. Some people might experience things like fatigue, headache, and dizziness, while others could face more serious complications like anemia. It's like having an unexpected and unwelcome party in your bloodstream. Now, here's the genetic twist. Favism is inherited, meaning it runs in families. If you have the specific genetic variants associated with favism, you might want to be a little cautious around those tempting fava beans. Interestingly, favism isn't just a modern-day concern. There are historical records suggesting that certain societies like the ancient Greeks were aware of the potential risk associated with fava beans. Some cultures even considered fava beans taboo due to these mysterious reactions. If you enjoyed, don't forget to hit that like button. Until next time, stay curious.